This is What's Trending from the Samsung Studio at VidCon 2014. And this is Jack Vale. Give it up for Jack Vale, everyone. <laughs> Who's this guy? How do you... I have no idea, but he's looking off in the, into the distance. I wonder what he's staring at. We'll never know. <laughs> you guys Whenever are big fans that, of each I other. I just do this. <laughs> I love farts so much. It's Let me tell favorite. you why I'm a fan of this guy, though. My son tells me he was in the Defy booth yesterday, and you were the only guy. So they have this thing oh, no. where you do this 3D scan. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, I was there. I was there. There's a 3D scanner. It scans your body, and then in a couple weeks, it sends you a little figurine of yeah. yourself in the I mail, right? Yeah. We all did it, but this guy, after I left, I was told, did it. With his pants down. One. So I was like, I, I was become, very offended. I could become a sex offender for doing this joke. I've reported it already. <laughs> oh, oh, God. I and, go. and you know what? It's all caught on camera. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Right. I got to go. go. The cops are. It's, it's out there. How's it going, Jack? It's going great. Nice to see you. Third Thank year you. at VidCon. Good to see you, too. You've, you've become known for these, obviously, these fart pranks. Yeah. How did that all start? So what was the inspiration? Well, you know, when I first started, I was kind of known. I'm still kind of known as the fart guy. So if you don't remember my name, you see my face, you associate it with farts. But uh, yeah, I do this. Can what is this thing? <laughs> did you create this or you bought it? I did. No, I, I did. Is this you, like you like, trademark this? This is mine, yes. Is it I, trademark fart maker? Uh, <laughs> it, you know what? It's funny because we've. I started out making YouTube videos producing these little fart noise makers, thinking like YouTube videos would be a good way to market it and sell it. So you actually created this? Yeah. The, the pooter. The pooter. We dot did. com. I know. What does your family think about the fact that you have built your business on farts? Well, it does really well, so they support it. <laughs> yeah, of course. Uh, my wife is extremely, like, she's like the fart queen. But I, after we started, I, I realized, like, this is not just a way to market this thing. It's, you know, uh, YouTube's a whole platform to make all these other funny videos and do pranks, you know, all the time. So one thing led to the next, and six or seven hundred videos later um you know it's a full-time gig and it's awesome what have been your favorite pranks that you've done uh probably you know the big one right now that i get asked about is a social media experiment yeah because I, basically i get to stalk people which is sort of like whether you want to admit it or not fun for everybody yeah and then go, go actually find them and by the time i find them and, and like search hashtags and i've located where they're at I've learned all this information about them by clicking on other posts, and then I can say, hey, Sarah, and you're Sarah, so you think you know me from somewhere. Yeah. So I can either pretend that I'm psychic, or which everybody buys it, or they think they know me from somewhere. And they just go with it. Yeah, they just go with it. What have been some of the craziest reactions that you've gotten? Um, I, I approached a couple once, and one guy was really happy about the fact that I knew all this stuff and convinced him I was a psychic and the other guy was mad and, and told me that he was going to call the cops if I stalked them again. But all of the information they put online was public information. Well, thank you yeah. so much for being yeah, here. Yeah, thank Jack you Jack Bell, everyone, thank you so much. <laughs>